Hi everyone, it's Akila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's the weekend and Leo is supposed to be getting ready for soccer practice. So let me make sure that he's up and ready. Leo, what's taking so long? Is everything okay in there? What the? Uh, mom? Who is that in Leo's room? That does not sound like Leo. Leo, honey, let me in, okay? Am I tripping right now? Where's dad? Uh, your dad's downstairs. August? August, come here. Something's wrong with Leo. And I'm not sure what it is, but he's asking for you. Hmm? Come in. Well, hurry up. What are you doing? Sitting on the couch eating chips? No. Then why do you got crumbs all over your mouth, huh? What's going on? Oh, there you go. You look a little more presentable. But I don't know what's going on. I, I was going to check on Leo because he has to go to practice. And he won't even let me in the door. He's asking for you. Leo, I brought your dad. Can you go ahead and open up the door now? Wait a minute. Who are you and what have you done with my cute, adorable little son? Who is that? Oh my, oh my gosh. It's, it's about, about time. time. <laughs> <laughs> what is funny? Do you see the way I look right now? Oh, we see. Yes, we see. It was a bit shocking like it all happened overnight. But I think it's time for the talk. Yeah, I'll go ahead and give you guys some alone time to have that talk. What talk? Oh, it's gonna be fun. I didn't expect for it to come this fast. Yep, this is my cue to leave. Excuse me. Just know it's a man talk. Now that you're a real man. Um, okay. When a man and a woman love each other. Uh-uh. I've already had this talk before. I'm kidding. It's a different talk. Sit down. What you're going through, it's called puberty. Uh-huh. Will my voice keep on getting deeper? Yes, it will. As you get older, you'll also experience things such as skin breakouts, body odor and hair, an Adam's apple, a what? And your thoughts and moods will change. An Adam's apple. Look at my neck. Well, try to. You see that bump? I would if I could, but... Oh, I see a little bump. That's the Adam's apple. As I was saying, remember when Layla started to break out? All those zits on her face? Don't tell me I'm gonna look like that. Well, you might. You just have to wait and see. It's nothing to be ashamed about. It's normal, so don't worry or be embarrassed. Yeah, I've been noticing some of those changes in my friends ever since I started middle school. Yeah, middle school is gonna be a rough one. Okay, truth is, I couldn't let Leo see how nervous I actually am. I hope the talk with him and his dad are going okay, but I'm a nervous wreck. We've never had a teen boy before. He's 12 years old and he's going to be 13 next year. So yes, we saw it coming, but we weren't ready for it. But I mean, realistically, I guess no one's ready for it. It just kind of happens like it did. When I'm stressed, I clean. I guess it's not the worst habit to have. But I mean, I just don't know what to expect. Yeah, he gets an attitude here and there, but I'm nervous for his teen years. We've only raised Layla and we know she was a lot, but it's teen boy i'm not too worried about leah she seems to have her head on her shoulders but livy the baby yeah she's gonna be psycho when she's older i'm not ready for those years i'm glad we still have some time left before those years but it's already happening with leo i mean you guys have seen leo grow up basically literally grow up he's like my height now scary right i just don't know how to feel like yes i'm excited and i'm blessed that we have a healthy 12 year old boy but oh my it's like yes i work at their school i work at the kids school if you didn't know i'm a teacher and i see these kids they're already growing facial hair and they're towering over me at this point grades are slipping all they care about is girls or boys we don't judge around here but i'm shaking in my boots right now one thing i know for sure is august better not be telling him 
some foolishness. He better be keeping it real. I just want our kids to be able to come to us about anything. I know it's awkward. I know not everyone has like the best relationship with their parents, but but I really try to, you know, make it work. But I think they're pretty open and honest about everything. For the most part, you know, kids will still be kids. I just hope August is being truthful. I know he's a little overprotective and what's the word I'm looking for? Aggressive? I don't know if that's the word, but it definitely suits him, but he means well. I also don't know how in detail he's getting. Like, don't scare the kid. We can gradually talk about things. Oh my goodness, I am so nervous. But I'll go check on them in a little bit. Okay, I hope I'm not cutting in on their conversation. It seems a little quiet. Let me just knock. Boys? Everything okay in there? Come in! Hey! How are you feeling now? How was the talk? We just finished the talk. I know it was kind of awkward, huh? Kind of. I don't get how you did this with Layla. I mean, my talk with Layla was awkward and I'm probably gonna have to have that talk with Leah soon. I'm kind of dreading it, but you know, it's, it's natural. I know, I still can't get over this. Your voice, oh my goodness. I couldn't even do it with Leo. And I'm glad I don't have to do it again. No more kids. I know that's right. We cannot handle that right now. But get up. Let me see you. Yeah, let's see how tall you are. Oh my goodness. You're like almost taller than me. Definitely taller than Layla was at this age. That's a plus. Yeah, um, well, do you have any questions? Any other questions that maybe I can help answer? Because I do have one tip for you. And it's definitely wash up wash up good with soap and water don't just be spraying on that axe cologne that all the teenage boys use it's gross it doesn't help you still smell musty i already do that and wear deodorant yes please wear deodorant yeah dad okay well um this is definitely a big change but I'm kind of glad. I can't believe all the kids are just getting so much older now. You think I'll be able to pull some ladies? Not smelling like that. You have some nerve, but you are a very handsome young man. And I definitely think you could find a, a really beautiful girlfriend later. Not now. Let's slow it down a little bit. Because no matter how big you get, you will always be my baby boy. What about me? What about you? Oh, you want to wipe my kisses off? Fine. I thought that was my title. Mwah. There, is that better? Some things never change. Gross. Oh, I have another question. Yeah, go for it. What is it? Do you think I'll be able to drive now? Drive? Drive what? Drive me crazy? Because you already do that. I mean, I learned when I was his age. You did? Then why do you drive like you do now? Because, honey, it is not cute. I think we can try. My vision is a bit blurry. I mean, all of our visions are blurry. We all have glasses here. I'm open to it, but I think we'll save that for another video. Okay, everyone. Well, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you have any encouraging tips for Leo as he is entering this new stage in his life, make sure you leave a comment. And if you enjoyed, do not forget to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below once you are subscribed click the bell button so you get notified whenever i post a video and with that being said i'll see you guys next time bye i won't make it easy for you now you got two minutes of my time and i don't really break too easily but i'm worth it because i'll slip into your dreams tonight